Now, forewarn weather with Exact Track 4D. So that's the good news of getting some rain. I guess later in the weekend it'll tap down the fire, the fire danger. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. But we will get some pretty heavy rain on Sunday, and we get dry weather tomorrow. So if you haven't done your taxes yet, <laughs> Sunday you can just stay inside and do your taxes. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got we've got something for everyone in the forecast tonight. It has just been such a nice night, almost like a summer night. 63 in Detroit, upper 60s in Howell. It is still close to 70 degrees. 11 o'clock at night and 69 degrees in Adrian. 64 in Pontiac. We did break a record today. The record was 81 set back in 2006 and we at 245 went to 82 degrees. So it was definitely a warm day and the daffodils are up. Crazy spotter one. That's the handle for this one. Ypsilanti. That's our my pick of the day. And if you have one, you can always send it to the forewarn weather app. The weather story. So tomorrow, most of the day will be dry. We just have a chance of a shower later on in the evening into the overnight hours, but not everyone gets rain tomorrow. In fact, much of the day will be completely dry. Then for Sunday, the best chance for rain is in the afternoon and the evening as the cold front passes and behind that cold front rain and the possibility of a few wet snowflakes. So here are the rain chances over the next seven days, possible Saturday at night for the most part, likely on Sunday and then Possible Monday as well, a good possibility on Monday and then again on Thursday. So let's time this out for you. Saturday at 8 a.m. we've got some sunshine for us. It'll be dry in the morning, very mild again tomorrow. So a good day to get outside, do the yard work. And then in the evening is when we bring in a slight chance of a shower, although it is fairly slight in the evening. The cold front stays back out to our west. Even Saturday morning or Sunday morning at 8 a.m., the cold front's still back in Chicago, so it's got a ways to go. It will arrive in the afternoon and bring us showers and maybe even an embedded thunderstorm. As I mentioned at the top of the show, we are in a marginal risk for severe weather. That's the lowest threat level, but we could get some gusty winds on Sunday afternoon and evening. Monday at 8 a.m., no big problems for your morning commute, but there will be some rain on Monday, and you can see the pink there and the blue indicating the rain-snow mix that will move through during the day and then clear out for Tuesday. Temperatures right now are so mild, 57 in Mount Clemens. That's a cool spot, but otherwise 64 in Pontiac, 65 in Ann Arbor. High temperatures over the next several days. We kind of just fall so quickly on Sunday, 74 Sunday and down to 48 on Monday, only rebounding to 51 Tuesday. Your forecast for tonight, 56 with just a few clouds. It'll be dry. Be a nice day for most of the day tomorrow, but in the evening, if you have some outdoor plans, just kind of check that forewarn weather app. Make sure there are no showers developing near you. Best chance for rain and storms is Sunday afternoon, continuing into Monday and colder on Monday with that high of 48. Lows will be dropping back down into the 30s, which after we've been in the 80s for, you know, several days, 30 uh, is going to feel really cold, but we do round, uh, rebound back to the 70s by the end of the week.